Hello, welcome to Maths with Jay. So we're going to be converting 25 to binary, octal and hexadecimal. So the first thing to do is to put the calculator in the relevant mode. So we want the mode button. And we can see that the key that we want is 4 because we want base n. We're changing the base of our number. So let's put in 4. And the DEC there is telling us that we're in decimal at the moment. The buttons that we want to look at for changing base are all on the same line. So DEC stands for decimal, HEX for hexadecimal, BIN for binary, and OCT is octal. So these are all in green. So let's start by putting in a number. Let's take um, 25. So all we've done so far is written 25 in decimal. So as expected, it is 25. So let's uh, put that into binary. So we can ignore all the leading zeros and we see that in binary 25 is 11001. And that's because it is 16 plus 8 plus 1. So now let's convert to octal. So remember, we're still looking at uh, the number 25. And that's 3, 1. Again, ignore the leading zeros. So that's 3 times 8 plus 1 is 25. And then finally, let's look at hexadecimal. And that's 1, 9. That's because the 1 is representing 16. So 1 times 16 plus 9 is 25. And then if you want to, do decimal. Obviously, it's still 25. And then most important of all, we want to get back out of this. So we need to press mode again. And we want uh, computational, so that's one. And we're back to normal. 